Hi there, welcome back to the Curious Expedition, Arctic Expanse Edition. Let's continue our expedition to number two. We have quite assembled some fame. We have lost someone, <laughs> the good sister Jenny. Let's see, maybe we can get someone else to follow us. Ooh, well, let's hope we don't kill them again. So, last time we were going for a lunatic area. What? Where will we go this time? Defiled or dark? I'm, I'm, I'm curious for this defiled jungle of Egypt. That's that's the, the most lunatic thing I can think of, so... Let's go for the defiled jungle. Let's start the expedition. Let's have fun together with Marie Curie. Eagerly anticipating the forthcoming adventure, I arrived at the hall. Not had yet to arrive, so I sat on the pier and waited. The scientist approached me this morning with a request. He told me about a mysterious box that was buried somewhere in the area we were traveling to. He promised to reward us generously if we brought it back to him. All right, we'll accept. He nodded gratefully and wished us well. Before his departure, he warned us not to open the box. I was delighted to witness the boarding of our ship had quite drawn the crowd. Many recruits showed up to learn the truth of the stories surrounding my endeavors. Who did I want to recruit? Ah, let's see. We have us and we have Nokohopa. And we have our good dog. And we have our good donkey, Mr. Baka. Ah, let's see. We could use someone more aggressive here. James Sterling or Zamazmi. Captain Sakuraya Dutton. What can he do? Mountain guide. Resu reduced movement costs when traversing hills. And that seems great, but I'd like to add someone. Maybe the diplomat. Decreases pricing when bartering. That's also very helpful, and he can fight. So let's let's take the fight, fighting diplomat James Sterling with us. It reinforced the expedition with a talent such as James Sterling. Just in time, the vessel was prepared to set sail. Let's purchase an animal improvement first, and then some equipment. I think we have quite the funds for that, so let's see. High quality work demanded a high price, but we could surely use the additional crates. One capacity for Mr. Vacker. Within an hour, his pack saddle had been upgraded and was able to hold an additional crate. A little trader branded the finished item with their respected mark and told me she was more than happy to offer her services again. Just in time, the vessel was ready for departure. Let's purchase some equipment. We need we need something for our sanity. So, um, and also we need ropes and maybe snowshoes. I mean, this is the Arctic expanse, right? But it's a defiled jungle. I don't know if we'll need that. I, d I don't think so that much. But in the jungle, you need maquettes, so we need these maquettes here. Then, what would we need? A pistol? Maybe a pistol would be nice for combat. Always helps so, lo so much. Pistol would be nice. Ooh. But we cannot afford it, really. We can go for some ropes. And maybe some torches, like two of them, and the rest I would like to invest in whiskey. Also for trading purposes. Ha! Huh. So. <laughs> Let's hope that will do well. Oh, we can, can we sell that? No, we cannot sell that. The tome page of Waterfall Creation. page that was ripped from an ancient tome. It is written in unearthly alien letters, but for some reason you know you can read it. We'll see if we can use that in the future. Let's make the deal. I think that's good, all in all, and let's hope for the best. Just in time, the ship was ready for departure. Set sail. Ho, oh, 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 oh. Expedition 2. It gets harder this time. The defiled jungle. What will we find? 
some Lovecraftian horrors. Already starting on a hill. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I was deeply absorbed in my studies about this area as a shoreline rose in the morning mist. I knew this place had something special for us. Let's refill water. Because you never know when you'll need that water, right? Let's begin the expedition. So, so, uh, we should have taken some dynamite with us, I suspect, but for now, let's go here. Oh, there's a lot we can we can see here. Already we know a lot. And we should probably go th through the thick jungle here to this question mark. Let's go. What will we find? And there we find the golden pyramid <laughs> and end the expedition for now. No. This opens up a lot of possibilities, though. Mm. There could be some of the hot springs here. There could be something here. I mean, we'll do this if, if or when we get back. Let's go to the shallow river here first. There's a waterfall. Let's explore it. Oh, and we've, we've learned something. James Sterling can upgrade. Nice. Arrived at a magnificent waterfall. It was an awe-inspiring sight. The water was fresh and cool. Let's uh, rest overnight, because we are in need of rest. Settled down to catch our breath. Night was bleak and everyone was seemingly worn out as we rested by the fireplace. James, James Sterling flailed as a giant butterfly flew past. The night he dreamt of giant butterflies planting its eggs in his ears. Oh, the ir irrationality of the human mind. He's now afraid of butterflies. Good stuff. Good stuff. We could rest again. This place buoyed my soul. Yeah, let's rest again then. Still have like the 40. Mm. This night we could hear the sound of drums from somewhere in the jungle. Nice. I knew we would f miss the peaceful hum of the falling water. This was truly a beautiful place. Yeah, it was. And now, where to go? We cannot move this way because we're blocked. Can just go through here. So let's go to this place. Travel. Cave entrance. Well, let's explore the cave, of course. Approach the cave. The rocky mall led into darkness of unknown depths. We needed a talk to move inside. Light the talk and explore. We talk and descended into the darkness. We arrived at a concealed opening in one of the walls that seemed to lead into another part of the cave. Only one person would be able to squeeze through at a time. We'll send in... Yeah, James Sterling. We made it, thank God. I ordered James Sterling to investigate the, the opening, or thank the science. After a few tense minutes, he crawled back out of the darkness. He found the skeletons of a long-dead expedition, a sign maybe, together with some valuable items that they absolutely had no need for anymore. Oh, let's let's take take everything. We have food cans, nice, and jewels, and we're overburdened. <laughs> We're not overburdened anymore. We have found food cans, which means we can explore a lot more. Let's try that. Let's travel here. A new region, even. Let's go to this place. This, this seems like a good idea. What is that? A trading caravan? Let's approach the trader. Roaming merchant caravan had pitched up camp here. The mysteriously dressed trader had a lot of useful goods on offer. A collection of lost and founds. Let's trade. He hesitated before presenting us with a selection of his wares. I could not help but think that he was hiding something from us. Can barter?
but he can. So if we select the Haggle skill... What? <laughs> From him? Then our value will go down. What the? He will sell us water. Oh my god. What can we sell him? What What is good to sell him? The page here? He doesn't want to buy. Oh, he wants to buy the jewels. And we can haggle and we'll give he'll give us more for the jewels. Very good. So the jewels it would be. Hmm. We we would like to have maybe elephant tusk. It would give us sixty funds for a value of thirty. That would be good. And what more? More food cans, maybe? Anything at a discount price? No? Mm, we would need... I mean, we have the scientist's map. We would need a shovel. And a food can. And another food can. And another food can. Let's make that deal. Wow! That was much. That was really much. Hmm. But then we're full, right? We're full. We're totally full. Let's maybe remove something like this and add more food cans. Maybe one rope. Yeah, I think that's the deal. Let's, let's do that. Traders seem expectant regarding our possible return as happy customers. But he hid something from us. We need to find that scientist's thing. Now we have so many food cans, we can, we can wander freely. Let's see. There's something here in the woods. Pass through here and avoid to use a machete. There's a crocodile too. Let's examine the shrine though. A long forgotten shrine, grand stairs lead to an en enormous doorway, a thick layer of sand. <gasps> so it's a desert shrine. I knew we would find riches here, if any were here. A kind of ceremonial room, let's investigate the altar. And there's a lot of fame to be found here. Hmm. Yeah, a talk. We need that to get back though. Let's take it. We took whatever we could and proceeded out life. As the plant life behind us began to wither and die, a drastic climate shift ravaged this region, and we were responsible. Oh no. But we have water. Two items overburdened. Let's eat some chocolate. Now we have wow, one more item slot ready. What's here? In the thick jungle, near the crocodile, we could find something maybe still need that thing for the scientist uh, we still need the climbing gear hmm. we need to remove the torque now that the climate change is coming we need all the water that we can get and we need to try to get get here travel Oh yeah, crocodile, go away, crocodile. What is that? A stone circle? Let's enter it. Came across a stone formation that was obviously man-made. There were inscriptions etched into each rock. Perf hey, perhaps they formed sort of a map. 
let's reveal maybe settlements, ruins, camp points. That would be nice. Hmm. Let's reveal some. Settlements will hate us now, so maybe ruins. There's a ruin here. Yeah, now what's in here? Oh, we should we should try that. We should try that really. Let's go here. Travel. Come on. Avoid the crocodile. Yes, we avoided it. Thank God. A native village? No. We'll not go there. Give Knocker a Hooper one more level. And now we're down to food cans. Only enjoyable to a certain degree. This reminds me of home. We can move over here. Oh, there's a sandstorm coming. Oh my god, we're in the sandstorm? We did it. What is that? A shipwreck. Sandstorm has stopped just in front of us. Let's explore. We found something of extraordinary interest. Before us led a mysterious, almost completely destroyed shipwreck. As far as I could tell, it must have been some kind of pirate ship. It seemed to be stranded here for a long time. I made an effort to read the name. The Alas Alanson Rosalinda. Oh my god, search the area. The place surely retains some trinkets of worth. We formed small teams and scoured the place. Dynamite. Dynamite's good. Dynamite is is really good. Wow. This is crazy. Ah. Uh, where should we go now? I mean, we have some water, thankfully. We should maybe return to this place. There's so much to explore here, but we need sanity. More sanity, more food cans, maybe. Even more sanity. Oh, thank God we weren't... We are not alcoholics right now. That's, that's good. Well, let's travel back here. Hopefully we can find the, the digging site for the scientist yet. Maybe this is the, the site. That would be awesome. <gasps> there's some kind of a puma. There's there's a butterfly. There's a mission. Let's enter the mission. Enter the mission and we were greeted by an old missionary. He rejoiced at the sight of new faces as they had operated remotely for longer than he cared to remember. Let's trade. The Holy One offered us some of his supplies. Yeah, we could fill up supplies here. Or we could sell him... What would he need? Oh, whiskey! He likes whiskey. You like whiskey? We'll give you whiskey. We'll take all the maquettes, though. And... Oh, um... This is costly, right? But it should work. Maybe one of these? No. We'll give you more whiskey. That seems like a very good deal. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> deal. Reach an arrangement with a missionary. Let's stay overnight, maybe. Priest surreptitiously evaluated our belongings. If we wanted to rest with a roof over our heads, we would have to make a donation. Of course. Oh, we should have done that before, right? My god. Alright, take these things. Wow. Three? Are you mad, man? No. Um, let's leave this place. We still have the food cans. Shook hands and he blessed our journey. Onwards. Onwards. Hmm. Move over here. Or this way. But I think first here. Let's travel. What's going on here? A cave! Another cave! Oh my god. 
Well, let's explore. Approach the cave. Its opening seemed to lead deep into the mountain. We required a talk to move inside. Explore in darkness. Well, I mean, we have a good chance, so let's try that out. Oh, we did it somehow. Who needed that? Which mankind had enjoyed since the Stone Age anyway? We pressed forth into the eerie gloom. Fate smiled upon us. We marched through the dark tunnel with little toil. Eventually our eyesight adjusted to the darkness. We found a small opening in one of the walls that seemed to lead into another part of the cave. Only one person could fit into the opening. We'll send James Sterling. He's a little mad, and he's not carrying that much. Hey, we did it. Very good. Sent James Sterling to investigate the opening. After a while, he emerged from the darkness. He found the skeletons of a long dead expedition, Sai maybe, together with some valuable items that they absolutely had no need for anymore. Let's loot. <gasps> wow! <laughs> We're well supplied here, if anything. Let's take the jewels. But what, what will we leave behind when we take the jewels? We don't need the water anymore, right? Let's, let's leave the water, let's take the jewels, there we go, and let's close it. Now, maybe we can go this way, let's try this out. I still want to find that thing of the scientist. Seems like it's not here though. No comment, they hate, they hate our food. So probably that thing from the scientist is somewhere in this direction. But I think we should ignore it. We'll also not go for the butterflies as they are much too dangerous for our good James Sterling. Let's instead go to the Golden Pyramid now. Maybe we can do it a second or something. Floor. The majestic golden pyramid rose above its environment. The sweet smell of achievement. Enter the pyramid. After weeks of traveling, tremendous relief overcame me. I knew that my name, Marie Curie, would be synonymous with victory. No regrets. The golden pyramid. New world bonus, speed bonus. Wow. We were so quick. We have a lot of fame. Let's see the map. Look at that. 136 days, 18 legs. A very short travel distance. A lot of the world discovered, but not one of the scientists. We traveled here, we traveled here. We traveled through the new found desert and back. <laughs> Let's finish the expedition. And we did survive. No one died. Yay! Triumph! What do we need? Occult vision. Explosion expert. Good reputation. Ah, that's not bad. I might rather go for strong mind or for good reputation. Explosion expert has something too. I think we'll go for the good reputation for a start. Let's go. Yay! Oh my god, Alistair Crowley. He's such a great guy. And what is... what about us? We're not bad as well. But nowhere near Alistair Crowley. Let's see, what should we sell, what should we keep? We need a lot of funds, so let's of course sell the elephant tusk and the jewels and we could give the golden dagger, give 70 fame, which is a lot because we have a lot of equipment already, so let's give the golden dagger and let's sell the golden goblet. So we're ahead of Crowley right now continue. Let's see where we will go next. There's the rich desert. Treasure. 
There's a lunatic arctic. A golden pyramid can be found in this region. The, the lunatic arctic. Desperate drylands. 